Hey everyone, thinking of giving your home a little TLC but not sure how to finance it? You've clicked the right video. Just a quick note, this isn't financial advice, it's a handy rundown to get your gears turning on the best way to fund your fixer-upper. Let's break it down. Option 1 is good old savings. If you've got cash earning around 4% annually in a savings or money market account, that's a cozy nest egg you might tap into. Pulling funds is a cinch, no applications or credit checks, and it's all yours, no interest payments. But here's the tax scoop, there's no direct tax benefit to using savings and you'll say goodbye to that interest income. Next up, the HELOC, that's Home Equity Line of Credit, if you're not into acronyms, it's like a credit line backed by your home's equity. To snag one, you'll need to prove you've got the credit chops with a solid score and a home valuation. It's a bit of a paper chase, but the payoff, the interest you pay, might be tax deductible if you're using it to improve your home's value. Just watch those rates, they can adjust over time. Or maybe you're eyeing a cash-out refi. This means refinancing your mortgage for more than you owe and pocketing the difference. It's a heftier process, more documentation, stricter income checks, and an appraisal. Why consider it? Even at a higher rate, the taxman could give you a wink. The interest may be tax deductible if used on home improvements. But crunch those numbers, refinancing ain't free, and closing costs can bite. So which path do you choose? Dipping into savings is straightforward, but nixes your interest earnings. A HELOC offers flexibility with potential tax perks, yet comes with variable rates. A cash-out refi could mean more cash up front with possible tax deductions, but it's a commitment with its own set of costs. It's a lot to ponder, so don't shy away from seeking advice from a tax pro to see what gels with your goals. All right, home heroes, that's the rundown on funding your home revamp. Savings, HELOC, or refi, they all have their quirks, perks, and homework to do. Keep those tax implications in your back pocket and choose wisely. Thanks for watching, and before you grab that hammer, grab some more insight by hitting that subscribe button. Don't be a stranger, like, subscribe, and drop your questions below. Stay savvy and happy renovating.